Hello everybody, this is the Hamptons Butcher. Today I'm going to be going over five different cuts of beef. Well, one, two, one's technically not beef, but that are great for keto, a ketogenic diet. This is going to be part of, a, I think, a three-part series that I'm going to be going over different uh, types of meat, um, lamb, pork, and I don't know if veal fits into this category, but um, a lot of people are really into the ketogenic diet now with all of its health benefits and uh, people are really losing a lot of weight with it so I figured hey let me do something about this to help some of you guys out there to decide hey what's a really good fatty piece of meat to help me out with this diet so alright let me start from the top this one here is a, uh, a boneless chuck roast and it's pretty fatty and delicious and the best way to cook it is in a crock pot or in a pot itself, it's best way to go is potting with it. It get really, it gets really tender that way, and uh, that's the best way to go with it. Below it here is uh, um, marrow bones, and this is great for like marrow bone soup, and it's very popular in Asian cultures, Central and South American cultures. The marrow inside is supposed to be really healthy for you, and has lots of minerals. And similar to that below is oxtails, and this is very popular in Asian cultures and. Uh, South American and Central American as well and it's really great soup and uh, it's really tender the meat inside and again with the the, mar uh, the nerves and stuff when it cooks it releases a lot of minerals into the meal and it's all these are really fatty and uh, uh, definitely not lean over here to my right this is a first cut fillet steak and this is considered the poor man's rib steak. It's a first cut leading into the chunk, the neck of the beef and it's connected to the rib. It's like that in-between piece and it's it's delicious. I buy it all the time. It's a lot more inexpensive than rib steak and this you don't get many out of one so there, there are always not many in uh, a lot of meat cases in supermarkets but it's really good and uh, it's a pretty good fatty piece of meat and above it's skirt steak. I'm sure all of you who have eaten at restaurants know what skirt steak is and why it's so delicious is the fat. The fat content is beautiful, makes it really tasty. And uh, these are one of my best steaks, favorite steaks. Um, I forgot to mention that the best way to cook these, uh, the first cut fillets, is in a pan on a barbecue, although you have to be careful because they're very delicate. And uh, some people even bake them in the oven. Uh, going back to the skirt steak, the best way to cook a skirt steak is either in a pan, a lot of people barbecue them, and uh, that's the technically, usually the best way to go. They're pretty easy to season, and I've never met anybody who didn't like one, so. All right, everybody, these are the five cuts of beef that uh, are best for a ketogenic diet, or I, I think, if you're a little confused uh, what to buy, this I hopefully, hopefully this will help you out, and um, also, I'll have a link below that I wrote an article about these cuts of meat. Uh, a little more in depth if you want to see that the link will be below and as always please like and share uh, you guys have been really helpful and my site's been my uh, my vlog has been really taken off so thank you everybody I really appreciate it All right, everybody this is the Hamptons Butcher again my website is www.thehamptonsbutcher.com and my Instagram is under the same name thanks everybody bye